All right, so the third boss in the Ruined City, which I will Let's hopefully get done with uh, today, is Lady Nazjar. Lady Nazjar. <laughs> Sounds like some nasty shit you'd put in a jar. Like, maybe you, like, you know, you're really sick and you're just like, ugh, ugh, and just put it in a jar. The Nazjar. That's what I imagine. Lady Nazjar has the final piece. The staff is within our grasp. That just reminded me of that, uh, that Spongebob episode where it's like, Firmly grasp it in your hand. Firmly grasp it. Firmly grasp it! And like stabs it through. <laughs> like my, I laughed so hard at that <laughs> episode. <laughs> Anyways, so um, at the end of your turn, replace all minions uh, with new ones that cost one more. Oh, grody, dude. Oh, grody, that's fucked up. Um, so I'm assuming it's for the enemy as well. Uh, so, ooh, you know what? You, let's let's do Death Rapper again because of the whole tempo thing. Probably get some hella good ass value from it. It is Nazjar. That's such a weird the name. The Yo, what's up, bitch? I'm Nazjar. I think we just replaced that one. Try to get like a one. Ah, oh, that sucks. Okay. So that that's bad. Um, that's still pretty bad. I am Sir Finley Margerton. Oh, oh my god. Holy shit, that's a sick animation. That's bad though. What the fuck? Uh, Here let's hit him there. Go. Wow, that sucks, man. Holy fuck. I really, I should probably restart this, right? Like, if you don't get out something first turn, you're pretty much fucked. Oh, that's actually pretty good for me. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good for me. Let's hit there. Put this bitch out and hit there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I can somehow still recover from this, guys. It's still possible. Oh, baby. Elise Starseeker. Well, I can hit there. This thing would still survive. I think also then we put out Pilot Shredder. Although, yeah, that's fine. Get back. So we hit here. And, and if he doesn't kill this, then this will be, like, reset as a minion with, like, more than one health. So I think that's good. Dash should play Fallout 4, though. Uh, Fallout 4. Not that I hate Fallout 4 or anything, it's just like, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what to say about it, it's like, I don't hate it, I really don't. Alright, so this is looking pretty good, we're gonna do this, we'll hit into here, drop the here, we're gonna jump up, um, do I pick this out or just leave it? Uh, yeah, we'll leave it. You can hear my germs? What the fuck does that mean? What the fuck does that mean? Are you making any new new music? Yes, actually. Indeed I am. Oh, fuck. So he got an Emperor Cobra from his thing. Well, that's too bad, because I'm gonna, I'm just gonna fucking destroy you. So, you know, hashtag your best. I would have um, put out Unearthed Raptor on this thing, but because it becomes a new minion, I don't think it really matters at all. So, Although this is a good trade, right? Because I, I get another 4-5. Yeah, so that's that's fine. And I don't think I don't think it matters who trades you. So. And then let's, let's just for the fuck of it put out one. Oh, yeah. Dude, I'm so hungry. It's, it's preposterous how hungry. I think we get the most amount of damage. That. That. Um, I guess it really doesn't matter if I put this thing out, huh? Whatever. Alright, so pretty much lethal next turn unless they have a board clear. 
Oh, that's not gonna help you, bitch. That's not. Oh my god, get get fucking shit on. Get legitimately shit on. Oh my god. <laughs> get fucking shit on. Oh yeah, that is so much weaker. It burns. Woo! Woo! Sick beans, guys. And we got a pit snake. Accompany me to the Hall of Explorers, and we shall assemble the artifact together. Together. <laughs> Your cards cost five. Oh, this is this is one of those really interesting cards that uh, I don't know where it belongs because it's like it's such a possibility that you know you put this card in your deck and like you have spells that cost like one or two, and then now all of a sudden they cost five. But it can be good if your deck is designed for just having retarded high minions. But then again, you put this thing out on turn 5, right? And you're hoping that it stays alive till the next turn. Or you put it out on turn 10, and then you put this thing out, and then something else nasty. My point is, you put this thing out, and it's not always guaranteed that it'll stay out. So, it's like, if you're gonna make a deck around this card, it just seems silly to me. So, I don't know. I don't know. Hey guys, what's up? Thanks for watching this Hearthstone video. If you guys liked it, make sure to click that like button and also the subscribe button to see more. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time.